James Mattis just drops major announcement, orders Pentagon to cut all soldiers who don't meet new requirement. James Mattis is a leader who puts America before governmental issues. America hasn't had a Secretary of Defense like that in quite a while. The Pentagon is considering its job important under his course. That implies holding our troops to a high standard. On the off chance that they are not prepared to fight when called on, at that point they shouldn't serve. So Mattis has established a strict new rule. It will hugely affect the military all in all. Via PJ Media Defense Secretary James Mattis said the new Pentagon policy that will remove service members who have not been deployable for a year or more is about fairly sharing the burden within the forces. At the end of the day, in case you're not being deployed, you're not in the military. En route to Washington on Saturday, Mattis told reporters that there is a higher expectation of deployability by our forces and the policy isn't to make change for change's sake, as he vowed when coming into the department. Mattis noted that if there are 100,000 troops and 10% are not deployable, then 90,000 deploy more often, obviously to meet the same deployment standard, so that's unfair. With a lopsided deployment burden, he added, if you can't keep the family together, then you're either going to lose the family or you're going to lose the soldiers, and that's a net loss for our society and for our military. It bodes well when you consider it. There are various service people who are on the military's finance, yet they're not serving. Envision having a staff that gets paid, however, does not work. To what extent will that work out for an office or company? Not long. Under Mattis, our military is intended to be as deadly and viable as could be allowed. It's about men and ladies who strive to keep us safe. The military isn't a nursery school for qualified youngsters to gather a paycheck. Don't imagine it any other way, liberals will whine about this move. They will rationalize benefit individuals who decline to work, yet need to be on the finance. However, as usual, it's a front to drain America of resources and strength. On account of Mattis, our military is considerable once more. We are seeing triumphs the world over once thought incomprehensible. This most recent move is just about enhancing our armed forces and guaranteeing our troops are pulling their weight. What do you think about this? Do not hesitate and write your thoughts in the comments section below. Thank you for reading. Thank you for reading.